Each year, an estimated 956 million tonnes of agricultural biomass are produced in Europe. That's the same weight as 162 Great Cheops pyramids. This is a valuable resource for the bioeconomy. But where is it all coming from? Thanks to a study by the European Commission's Joint Research Centre, we can dig deeper. Three quarters of the EU's agricultural biomass are produced in seven member states. 54% of it is made up of the grains, fruits, roots and tubers, which are used mainly for food and animal feed. These primary products are the main reason crops are cultivated. The remaining agricultural biomass comes from residues like leaves and stems. Cereals make up much of the total mass, accounting for more than half of the primary products and three quarters of residue production. Such scientific evidence helps inform policy making, but there are still gaps in the data. For example, how can we accurately estimate residue production and exploit this biomass sustainably? Currently, the data is based on estimates from models, and there is little insight on the amount of residues that are actually removed from fields and used. Leaving enough to ensure healthy soils is crucial and also helps to protect biodiversity. We need to be able to estimate how much is needed to deliver ecosystem services like soil protection from erosion, to ensure agricultural residues are used sustainably as part of a circular bioeconomy. Download the full brief and discover more about biomass at the Knowledge Centre for Bioeconomy website.